give her a big round of applause. So, one of the things is we are, um, we also want to bring um, some words from nonprofits from the community. So, I would like to talk about two groups and we have several throughout the whole program. Um, so, as we celebrate Diwali and Eid here in the subcontinent, we also want to nourish the fire in our hearts to bring about positive change in our society. I would like to invite Shumnath Mukherjee to talk about a local nonprofit called Association for India's Development. Shumnath is the development coordinator in aid and spends time traveling to various rural parts in India, working with the poorest of the poor, and is involved with several social justice causes in the area. Thank you. I'm um, Somnath and um, I'm part of this volunteer organization called Association for India's Development. Uh, we, are, we have about 40 chapters in the US and uh, people in the local areas volunteer. And we work with grassroots groups in India trying to understand the, uh, the basic causes, what, what causes uh, poverty in India, what keeps people in poverty in India. And in, in working for about uh, 20 years, we have found that it's a much more complex problem than just not having money. And the roots of these problems lie in various spheres like agriculture, in health, in education, in social justice, in denial of rights. So volunteers uh, gather here. Uh, we meet in the Harvard University campus every Sunday at 2 p.m. And we discuss different projects in India. And pro uh, our uh, volunteers from here also go and visit the projects in India. And we have speakers and workers and social activists in India who come and enlighten us on the issues that are going on in India. And uh, we have, uh, over the years, formed a very strong bridge with the rural population in India, with the marginalized uh, communities in the cities of India. And it's uh, open to everyone to come and participate. We also hold fundraisers. A uh, few, uh, few weeks ago, we had a, a, a dance recital by Pandit Birju Maharaj. Tomorrow, along with another group that you will hear about, we are having uh, another uh, concert in Kresge with Shankar Tucker and several other vocalists. And uh, so money raised from these concerts go to support the projects uh, that we uh, do in India. So with this, uh, I would just hand it over to back to Mona and say thank you to you all. A quick translation of that is, we are not flowers, but flames from Bhopal. This is a slogan that has been popularized by the Bhopal campaign, which raises awareness about the 1984 Bhopal gas tragedy. Even after 28 years, the spirit of the campaign inspires us all, and the baton has been passed to the next generation of young Bhopalis who are impacted by the env environmental contamination and several myriad of issues in the area, which has made the groundwater toxic and undrinkable, amongst one of many human rights violations. I would like to invite my friend Karthik Shaker. Karthik is a PhD student from MIT and he will be saying a few words about the international campaign for justice in Bhopal. Good evening, uh, Shubh Dipavali or Eid Mubarak. My name is Kartik Shekhar uh, and I'm a volunteer with Boston for Bhopal. And as Mona foreshadowed, the objective of this group is to press Union Carbide and its current owner Dow Chemical to clean up the plant site that was abandoned since the Bhopal gas disaster, which is a source of many, many toxic chemicals that have leached into the groundwater, that have condemned future generations to a life of ill health. And we also hold the issue of Bhopal and the struggle for justice as emblematic of a larger issue of pressing corporations to be responsible. And to this end, we have a concert tomorrow, as Somnath mentioned, 
the proceeds from this concert will go to su supporting survivor groups and groups across the world who are trying to raise awareness for the victims and survivors of the Bhopal disaster. Please come and join us. This is by Shankar Tucker. In case you haven't heard of him, tomorrow would be a good opportunity to do so. Uh, uh, this will be at MIT, and we have some flyers out there. Please feel free to stop any of us and ask more questions. Thank you very much. So the next piece is actually a dance piece. So we need some of you to move a little 